find the square root of 38 to find the square root by long division method for that first we should frame it in this way c that is 38 okay next now here we have 38 38 is not a perfect square so now we should check 38 lies between which two perfect square numbers perfect square numbers are these that is c 2 into 2 4 3 into 3 9 4 into 4 16 5 into 5 25 6 into 6 36 7 into 7 49 and it goes on <coughs> these numbers are called perfect square numbers here we have 38 38 lies between these two numbers so we should take the smaller number that is 36 36 is for 6 into 6 so 6 6 36 now you subtract 38 minus 36 is 2 okay now here we should add these two numbers and write here so 6 plus 6 we get 12 okay now now i should write a number here when i write the number here then this number will be smaller than this so in normal division what we used to do we used to put a decimal and take one zero but here we should take two zeros while finding the square root we should take two zeros not one remember that next now here i have to write a number condition is whatever number i write here here also i should write the same number and also when you multiply this number and this number then the resulting number should be either equal to this or smaller than this but should not be larger than this number okay so let us find the number here if i take 2 i should also multiply by 2 these two numbers should be same so 2 into 2 4 2 into 2 4 2 ones 2 this is exceeding 200 so you can't take 2 you directly take 1 so 121 into 1 1 is 121 now you subtract so here 1 9 0 9 10 10 minus 1 9 9 minus 2 7 1 minus 1 0 here you add these two numbers and write here 121 plus 1 is 122 okay next now i should write a number here when i write the number here then this number will be smaller than this we already have a decimal so you directly take two zeros okay now i should write a number here condition is whatever number i write here here also i should write the same number and also when you multiply this number and this number the resulting number should be either equal to this or smaller than this but should not be larger than this number okay so let us find the number here if i take 2 i should also multiply by 2 because these two numbers have to be same so 2 twos 4 2 twos 4 2 twos 4 2 ones 2 this is far from this so let us take 5 so 1 double 2 5 into 5 
फाइव इंटू फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव सो फाइव टू फाइव टू टेन प्लस टू टूवेल्व सो टू वन फाइव टू टेन प्लस वन लेवन सो वन वन फाइव वन फाइव प्लस वन सिक्स इवन दिस ऑल्सो फार फ्रॉम सेवेंटी नाइन हंड्रेड सो लेटस टेक सिक्स सो वन डबल टू सिक्स इंटू सिक्स सिक्स इंटू सिक्स थर्टी सिक्स सो सिक्स थ्री सिक्स टू ट्वेल्व प्लस थ्री फिफ्टीन सो फाइव वन सिक्स टू ट्वेल्व प्लस वन थर्टीन सो थ्री वन सिक्स वन सिक्स प्लस वन सेवन सेवन थ्री फाइव सिक्स इफ वी टेक सेवन दैट विल डेफिनेटली बी लार्जर दैन दिस नंबर सो वी टेक सिक्स सो यू टेक सिक्स हियर हियर सिक्स एंड हियर सेवन थ्री फाइव सिक्स नाव यू सब्ट्रैक्ट सो हियर एट नाइन टेन टेन माइनस सिक्स फोर नाइन माइनस फाइव फोर एट माइनस थ्री फाइव सेवन माइनस सेवन जीरो हियर वी शुड एड दीज टू नंबर्स एंड राइट सो वन डबल टू सिक्स प्लस सिक्स इज वन टू थ्री टू नाव आई शुड राइट अ नंबर हियर When I write the number here, then this number will be smaller than this. We already have a decimal, so you directly take two zeros. Now I should write a number here. Condition is whatever number I write here. Here also I should write the same number, and also when you multiply this number and this number. the resulting number should be either equal to this or smaller than this but should not be larger than this number so let us find the number here if we take 4 that is 1 2 3 2 4 we should also multiply by 4 these two numbers should be same so 4 into 4 16 6 1 Four two eight plus one nine. Four three is twelve. So two one. Four two is eight plus one nine. Four one is four. So we got around forty nine thousand. What if we take five? One two three two five into five. Five into five twenty five. So five two. Five two is ten plus two twelve. So two one. Five three is fifteen plus one sixteen. So six one five two is ten plus one eleven. So one one five one is five plus one six. So this is larger than this. So we should take this number that is for four and four. So you take four here. Here also four, and here four nine two nine six. You subtract this, and it goes on. It is. enough if we find up to 3 decimal places so the square root of 38 is this one 6.164 goes on so this is our answer am i clear